Hello everyone. This is the second video in the group policy management playlist. In the first video, we just we checked the theoretical part of group policy. What is group policy? And I just introduced the group policy management uh, portal before you. So in this video, we will be practically creating a group policy and applying that in the domain level. So we are creating a, a group policy to disallow control panel access to a domain user. So let us create it and practically check how it works. To create a group policy, we will have to open the group policy management. As I showed in the first video, you have you can get it either from the server manager. We go to server manager and go to tools, group policy management. That will land on this portal. Or either you can go to run and type gpmc.msc. Even that also will will land over here. So click on the group policy management. I have already opened here and we are planning to create a new group policy. So I'm going to create a group policy to disallow control panel access to a end user. To do that, I'm clicking on the domain and trying to create a GPU in this domain and link it here. And we have to name the GPU. I'm giving a name like this allow control panel access control panel access this allow control panel access okay so you can see that uh, gp over here and right click on that and click on edit so we are apply we have to we can apply either in the computer or configuration or in the user configuration we in this we have to apply it in the user configuration click on policies and click on administrative template where here we have control panel click on that here you could see prohibit access to control panel and pc settings click on that double click on that it, it is not configured as of now so we can enable it and apply it okay so the prohibit access to the control panel is applied in the domain level in this particular <coughs> domain so i'm closing this gpo is applied to the domain level login as a domain user and check it out whether this particular group policy applied to a domain user for that i have already logged in uh, a client machine over here we go to the command prompt and check it out who am i you can see uh, in my name you can see an account here it's a domain user in the joy root so presently whether i let us check whether i'm able to access control panel so I'm typing here control panel. Yes, I'm able to access control panel. So it should be blocked. So it will take some time. This group policy get applied to the domain uh, to a domain user. Uh, either you have you can restart this machine or you can type gp update slash force. So this group policy will be forcefully applied updated and applied to this domain user so it is take computer policy applied has successfully user policy or update user policy update has completely completed successfully so whether it got applied or not we can check it with some other command which is gp result slash r so we could see whatever got applied to this machine will be will be visible here See, applied group policy object disallow control panel access is got applied now so let us check now whether we are able to access control panel or not so open control panel now see, it is giving an error this operation has been cancelled due to the restriction in the effect of on this computer please contact your system administrator so this is the way how we can apply a group policy to the, in the domain level so in the coming videos we will be taking more scenarios and we'll be we will be creating new group policy and applying it in the domain level and even the organization units and we will be working on that so stay tuned watch my videos goodbye